Oh boy. Alden's tearing across that bridge, heading for the historic district. Stop him before he reaches the other side. I'm on it. Yeah, so if we saw the last video, <laughs> Zeke effed up again. Like, so majorly. Extremely majorly. And this will be the last mission of the second island. So this is going to be your big showdown of Alden. Unfortunately, the biggest problem with this uh, mission is your visibility. Uh, what the hell is going on? There's something wrong with your phone. Every time I try and call you, I get disconnected. I don't have time to run the tech support for you, Boya. Figure it out yourself. Later. And Cole is, <coughs> as you would imagine, quite upset. But yeah, you're gonna make your way on top of the bridge girders. But just be careful because soon you're gonna head into a whole bunch of smoke, which will cut your invis uh, your visibility down to zero. But what you can do is uh, yeah, just be careful because soon there's gonna be a car that lunges its way towards you. But yeah, just use your um, your magnetic pulse. And you can find out where enemies are. I mean, you can kind of make them out because they're little white, I don't know, silhouettes through the smoke. But, and also your reticle will turn red as well. But uh, if you use your magnetic pulse, those little white silhouettes will turn red so you'll know they're enemies and not just I lights. Know you're back there, electric man! And here I didn't have a lot of energy starting out, so I was actually low on energy the entire time. But yeah, we're almost done. Only ten more videos left. The historic district does not have yeah, that's the uh, that's the name of the next island, or where the last island is, the historic district, and it surprisingly does not have a lot of missions. So this is almost done, just about, just hang in there. This boss fight will be just like fighting a giant golem. They use the exact same attacks, except for one new addition is this guy uses um, fireballs, which set fire to areas of the platform that you're on. It isn't too bad, it's just more so about endurance. Um, when he throws fire, when he throws giant trash chunks at you, you use your shockwave to blow them away. When he spits, you know, little mini rocks at you, use your barrier to absorb it and then when he shoots fireballs at you just um, run away and make sure you don't touch the fire and then he'll spawn little crab things at you so just take them out with one shot 
You think you can hurt me? Nothing. But don't let the crab things distract you because he's gonna continue to fight you even though. You and Kessler are one and the same. You got some serious issues, you know that. And there's maybe a couple sources of energy nearby. So don't overuse them. Just be careful. And then obviously once you do enough damage to him, he'll slump over and expose. The golem will slump over and expose Alden, so give Alden everything you have, but keep a little bit left over so that you can, you know, keep a little bit of your battery left over so you can uh, use your shockwave to uh, repel those giant rocks. But overall, this, this boss is a cinch. I mean... To be very honest, the bosses in these games were kind of easy. Um, but they weren't too challenging, even on hard. Uh, maybe the final boss was a bit tough on hard, just because it was an endurance. Wow, that actually just clear lock knocked me over. But even the last boss took me maybe two tries on hard. And it was more so about getting your momentum and figuring out the final boss's pattern. Not to say the game wasn't challenging. The game was cheese. The game was challenging, just the bosses were a little bit on the easy side. And that's it. I'll kill you! That whore! And your thief of a friend! All of you! Alden no longer seemed like a threat to anyone. Just some old guy howling about how Kessler had stolen his first son birthright. Then he changed his tone. Claimed he wanted to work with me to get revenge. To join forces and kill Kessler. The guy must have felt my hesitation. Because in that moment of indecision, I jumped. No normal man could have survived that fall. But Alden's a conduit. Same rules don't apply. Either way, this thing's coming to a head. My enemies are all gathered here in the historic district. Kessler's preparing them for the final battle. Yeah, this is the finish line. Just wish I wasn't crossing it alone.